In this lesson, I'm going to demonstrate the techniques used to evaluate regular expressions using PHP. We're not going to write a full-blown PHP program that's inside a web page or anything like that. This is going to be a very simple script, just so you can see exactly how to evaluate a regular expression. Also, I'm only going to demonstrate in this lesson one of the possible functions we can use to evaluate regular expressions in PHP. And by the way, we are using the Perl compatible regular expression functions or the PCRE functions. And the one function we're going to look at in this lesson will be PREG underscore match. So let's start a new PHP program. Again, it's going to be a very simple one. I'll write my tags in first. And the first thing we're going to do is create our pattern. And our pattern is the regular expression that we're going to be searching for. Now we haven't learned about meta characters or anything like that. So we're going to start off with just a very simple literal. Now, with grep we were able to just put the literal in on its own. But PHP wants us to put the regular expression inside a delimiter. So we're going to use slashes, which is the standard for the delimiter. You can use other delimiters, but the slash is a standard, so you should probably stick with that. Next, we'll provide a string to evaluate. Here's a JavaScript line of code. So we'll be looking for the pattern in that string. The next thing we're going to do is call the function pREG underscore match. It returns an integer value that stores the number of matches that was found when the regular expression was evaluated. So we can put that in an if statement like this. So there's the function call. The arguments for this particular example are the pattern and the string. There are other arguments, but we'll look at those later in the course. And here we'll just echo that a match was found, or otherwise, match not found. Again, I'm not trying to demonstrate any complex regular expression techniques. I just want you to see the logistics of getting a regular expression evaluated in PHP. Again, the PREG underscore match function takes, in this instance, two arguments, the pattern and the string. And the order does matter, of course, so the pattern has to come first. And then if a match is found, then this condition will be essentially true, and match found will be displayed. Otherwise, match not found will be displayed. So let's save that, go back to our command line, and let's run it. Oops, have a little typo there. We'll fix that real quick. Let's go to our command line, run it again, and we have match found. Let's change the pattern just a bit. We'll put int instead of var. Now it looks like we're trying to perhaps run a C++ or Java program or evaluate one. Now let's run the code again. And this time you see match not found. So to wrap up, the primary function that we're going to use to evaluate regular expressions in PHP is PREG underscore match. It takes at least two arguments, a pattern or regular expression, followed by a string to evaluate, and it will return the number of matches. Later in the course, I'll show you how to work with that return value and how to even save the matches in an array so that you can look at them later. But in this lesson, all I wanted to convey again was the technique for evaluating regular expressions, and we've seen that. So that wraps up this lesson, and we're going to move on to the next lesson where I'm going to show you how to evaluate regular expressions using JavaScript.